Out with the TV. Now I can find Dylan.
villain. So close. Dylan isn't here. He might be nearby. Or maybe the hiss got to him. I don't know. Jesse, listen. Dylan's here. With us. He just walked in. He says he is giving himself up. He's been affected by the hiss, but, but he is different than the others. We must isolate him. I'm on my way. We need to get back. I have to see my brother. Take up too much of your time today, Dylan. Like I said, I want to talk about Jesse, her sister. What about her?
Did you hear that the his prisoner they captured was The resonance emitted from the HRAs is purely antithetical to every variant of the his signal I can arrange. But how did Darling create it? It's happening. After all these years, Dylan is here. Oh, but am I too late? How is he? I need to know. He's clearly been affected by the hiss, but it's different than any other manifestation we've recorded. Maybe what makes you so special is genetic. He was a prime candidate. Or maybe it's Polaris protecting him, something else affecting the situation. I need to run tests. He seems more in control, more present. I want to see him. My brother? Or is he? Of course. Now, Marshall set up an HRA warded cage to contain him. It's on the upper floor, up the stairs. Okay, I need to go. Jesse, be careful. Hi, Jesse. I visited the quarry. What's the plan for all that Black Rock? The Bureau has used Black Rock almost exclusively for containment purposes. See, I say, branch out. Instead of boxes, helmets. Instead of blast shields, knives. Knives? Yes, knives. So many combat applications. Slicing, stabbing, gouging. Or Sorry. I've been trying to get Darling to explore combat applications for years. I've got a little excited. Wow. I did not expect that from her. This place is looking good. Arish is making real progress around here. Right? This place is a fortress. And with him taking care of operations here, I can spend more time analyzing the hiss. I've been attempting to isolate and neutralize the Hiss resonance in blood samples, but no luck so far. So you can't reverse it? Not yet, but perhaps reversing it is too simple. See, if Hiss resonance can rewrite human genetics, then perhaps it's a question of rewriting the Hiss resonance. In theory, that could pave the way for custom human genetic alteration. I wonder how often the phrase mad scientist is used around here. How is HRA production coming along? Better than expected. We've already made enough to get people out of a couple safe rooms. And they're here, alive, thanks to you. And we never would have lasted this long if you hadn't walked in those doors. You deserve thanks too, of course. We got this place up and running together, Emily. I should be going. Enjoy your data. Oh, I will. <laughs> oh, my God. Did she have to write everything in her made up gibberish code? Fucking Marshall with her CIA spy shit. God. this token. Any idea what it does? Ah, that is a jukebox token. Little bastards turn up in the weirdest places, like bad pennies. The rangers use them to activate an old object of power. A jukebox, I assume. Does it have any good songs? Nope, just the one record. Hey, be careful turning it on, though. When it's playing, you get a free trip to the formation. The formation? That sounds ominous. Why does it send you there? Well, the Bureau has been wondering that for years. I mean, it's just a pile of rocks built by God knows who, but... Well, researchers have confirmed it's in the same threshold as the quarry. 
No one's ever been able to map a physical route to the formation for maintenance. So it's in the quarry. You just don't know where. Pretty much. We only send in annual expeditions to the formation now. Checkups, Salvador calls them. This year's team went in the day the Hiss arrived. Come to think of it, the song should have brought them back hours ago. I can go in and take a look. I'd appreciate that. The jukebox is kept just past the security booth over there. Just put in the token and enjoy the ride. What's the deal with Blackrock? Oh, fuck. Don't get me started on Black. You know, ever since research found out that it blocks Parent have just been parading dangerous materials in fucking lab coats, man. Look, making my job harder. Sounds like there's some tension between departments. Still, at least the quarry's got a good view of the night sky. You know, me and Salvador used to have after work beers down there. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Remember, we got this. Need something? That's the block. This is Lynn Salvador, head of Bureau Security. I'm making a formal security order due to the incident in April, case number 21HQ593. Improper use of the jukebox altered item led to two fatalities. We believe a pair of agents used the jukebox to travel to the quarry threshold and engage in inappropriate workplace behavior. An expedition team found them decomposing at the formation's base a week later. At least we found out the jukebox doesn't bring corpses back when the song ends. I'm having the jukebox placed in a secure location in the executive sector. It should never have been accessible to low clearance staff in the first place. The new location security and proximity to a high traffic area will prevent misuse while still allowing for expedition teams to access it when required. See me for any further details. Why haven't we dissected that freak mutation we locked up? We could learn so much from its physiology. He's a valuable resource, Alar. And Pope forbade any physical problem. What can I do to help? I don't think I ever told you this, but I was actually on the path to being a ranger once. Did the whole boot camp thing. Even got rookie status. Anyway, not the point. My own ranger squad was a great bunch. There were six plus me. Remus, Hazard, Cho, Guy, Hepton, Stall, and Thompson. They were supposed to get back from an expedition yesterday. We had beers and wings planned. Problem is, they weren't here when Darling handed out the HRAs. Then they had nothing protecting them from the Hiss. You see, they prepped for the worst, but I think that we're already past that. We all wore these pouches around our neck. And I really don't want the Hiss to get them. Could you find them for me? Uh, the squad would have come back through maintenance, but they probably spread out from there. I'll keep an eye out for them, Arish. And I won't let them stay his. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know. Hey, watch yourself out there. Us. I'm sick of no one telling us what's going on. Information's always been on a need-to-know basis. Well, I need to fucking know. I'm an upper-level executive. <laughs> Apparently, the director restored HRA production. They're already getting... How are you? They're in 
endangering us by bringing a hiss in. He's still around. He's still around. This is Lynn Salvador. This is Lynn Sel. Stars. That certainly looks like the same sky as the quarry. Yes, I should look for those rangers.
flashing light. They must have gone that way. There are so many. You want to get out? Get out. No! The hiss. They're here. Guess the song ended. Good timing. Fuck, if they're in there, we go around that one. There you are. Did you, uh, did you find those rangers at the formation? I found them. But it's not good news. The Hiss got there first. Lots of them. Oh, another dead team. You know, I should have seen this coming. The formation, it's got like a, a pull to it. Things just end up there. I'm sure you saw all the junk from the Bureau lying around. There were a lot of hiss, Arish. I mean, a lot. Did they get pulled in too? Or they forced their way in. The formation is just a big question mark to us. But who knows? You might even find some useful stuff down there. All I know is we cannot let the hiss get comfortable. Sounds like you have a plan. Uh-huh. A simple one. You need to find more tokens and clear the hiss the fuck out of the formation. That is simple. Oh, and I found a file on the formation while you were gone. You take a look for yourself if you want. A lot of the terms in there are way beyond me. <laughs> I don't like to overcomplicate these situations. When in doubt, fuck it. Shoot something, right? <laughs> Real helpful, Arish. <laughs> I try. I have to go. Me too. You're not the only one who's busy, you know.
Remember, we got this.
through time. The thunders hum distorted zero. Happiness comes, white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror inverted his new right. They fear and by the door, push the thing through the surface into the way. You've always been in your youth. Why this is betrayal? We stand around you while you dream. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. Through time, the thunders hold the soul at zero. Happiness comes, white pearls, but yellow and red in the eye. Through a mirror, the inverted is near right. They fear and by the door, push the thing through the surface into the way. You've always been in your youth. Why this is You are a warm through time. Shit. That's Dylan. Can you hear me? Oh, come on, Dylan. I'm here. I found you. Do you know who I am? Oh, you know me. Say it. You are Dylan Faden's sister. He's talking in the third person. Always a good sign. Do you know who you are? Not Dylan. Trench and Darling made sure of that. I'm P6. P6. But I'm better now. The hiss made me better. Push the fingers through the surface into the wet. You've always been the new you. You want this to be true. Can you stop true. that? Please. <sighs> Not exactly the reunion I'd hoped for. It feels good to say those words. I want to say them. They sound good. They make me feel good. Don't you want to say them too? No. Fuck off, no. You need to help me get this thing out of his head. If he is still in there, if there is anything left, you have to you. help me. You! You came in through the hole in you! We let you in! You've always been here! The only true! A copy of a copy of a copy of a copy! Stop it! Orange peel! Shit! Shit! He can see you! This is not safe! We found Polaris together with my sister when we were very small. In ordinary. In the desert through the door opened up by the slide projector. But she didn't help when Trench took me away. She didn't give me any powers. All the powers are my own powers. And <laughs> she didn't help when they locked me up for years. After the song time for applause, we build you till nothing remains. The air cracks and the truth will emerge out of you. You are home. The Bureau brought the slide projector back here with me. And the Bureau did what the Bureau does. They used it. And they found... They opened the door up to the hiss. That's the only thing I can thank them for. There. There it is. We stopped the Altered World event in Ordinary when we shut down the slide projector. And now the projector's here. I need your warm as a tune you can't stop humming in a dream. Baby, 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 yeah. Just plastic. So safe. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Funny. I welcomed the hiss. I let it in. To get rid of her. The hiss set me free. Polaris is using you. The Bureau is using you. You are a puppet. You can almost hear our words, but you forget. If we shut off the slide projector, maybe, maybe that will stop the hiss. Maybe it's not too late for my brother. You must see the truth for yourself, Jesse. Sister. The horrible truth about the Bureau. The hiss is the better option. Go to the prime candidate program in the containment sector. I have the key card to get you there. Salvador wanted me to have it. Wanted? Bullshit. I saw what the hiss did to Salvador. What it turned him into. 
Okay, Dylan. I'll go. I want to see the truth for myself. I'll go. But only to look for this lie projector. You can help me. We can end this. You are a worm through time. You are a worm through time. The thunder's who distorts you. Happiness comes white pearls but yellow and red in the eye. I don't know what else I'm hoping to find here. Dylan. Can we talk? I'd like to tell you about a dream I had last night. Off to a good start. Okay. I'm listening. I was back in ordinary. Before all of this happened. But in the dream, I was alone. It was just me. I was the only child. A girl. My name was Jesse Dylan Faden. But then the Bureau came and caught me, brought me back here, locked me up. Have you ever noticed that our names, Jesse, Dylan, they could be girls' names, boys' names, could be anything. Don't you find that weird? I find that weird. Sure. What the hell was that? Is he trying to mess with me? You are a worm through time. The thunder's who distorts you. Happiness comes. Maybe Dylan's still in there. Maybe there's a way to reach him. I'd like to talk to my brother, please. Dylan? Dylan would like to tell you about a dream he had just now. This again? I was going to be the new director of this place. I helped you get a job here, so that we could be together. You were an office assistant. You'd make coffee and deliver the mail, and there was always plenty of work to do. And it stayed that way, forever and ever. It was nice. Really nice. That's debatable. But here's the strange thing. The dream shifted, and none of it was real anymore. It was a game. We were in a game, and it was a fucking boring game. But you couldn't stop playing. And then it shifted again. Or maybe it was another dream already. Or maybe I'm just confusing them. But in this other dream, it was more like a musical. This is an ordinary song about an ordinary girl from an ordinary town. It's the ordinary story. She worked an ordinary job in an ordinary office and something, 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 something. And that's all I can remember of that dream. Maybe that's for the best. You are a worm through time. The thunder who distorts you. Happiness comes. White pearls, but yellow and red.